it appears, though, that you uh, would like to see him stay rather than go. Why? Yes, I think we would actually be much better off if he gave a few more years to the job. I don't expect him to do that. It's pretty clear, uh, obviously. But here's the thing. Five years is enough time to kind of find out where the bodies are buried, what the problems are, and to to learn a little bit. But to actually implement the things that you've learned, it's really not enough time. And I've, I've seen uh, Erskine Bowles views somewhat change over the years so that let me give you an example when he started out in his inaugural speech in 2006 he talked about the need for more teachers and he also mentioned they needed to be better but it was more teachers in North Carolina being produced by education schools well over the, ne the next year or two it, it became clear that North Carolina does not have a big shortage of teachers it does have a shortage of good teachers and Bowles began to implement a study that is kind of, it's called a longitudinal study in which you try to find out whether the, um, which teachers have the best outcomes with students and then where they came from, which schools are producing the best teachers. Well, that study isn't even over. It's, it's in the, the, the um, I don't know, one phase of the research, mm -hmm. the final phase of the research. But actually implementing something is going to take more than one year, which is at most that he, all that he has left, and not even that. So I feel that he would be, the university system would be much better off if he could have stayed longer.